welcome back to another video we're in the car we're in arizona if you guys saw the last video we road tripped from michigan like detroit to phoenix and it took us 34 hours no 30 30 32 hours i think it was like 32 32 hours i think we did 14 we did 14 like 11 so that would be 25 and then we did like eight the last day so like 32 or 33, 33 hours 33 would be and now we're finally in arizona we're running a ton of errands today because yesterday we got in and we went to the grocery store and like unpacked all of our stuff but um <laughs> this road's really bumpy but that was pretty much all we did because we were like tired from driving and stuff so we're going to costco um, the boom. <laughs> oh yeah, we're going to Dutch Bros first because I really wanted to get Dutch Bros coffee. I took a half day this morning too, so I worked 5 a.m. to 10 a.m., which is why we have like all afternoon now, which is really nice. Um, we went to the gym and like showered and yeah, made she breakfast. Got a fresh <laughs> and got, looking swole. And got all that stuff done this morning. And That's so yeah, we're gonna take you guys along. I'm gonna do a couple days in Arizona vlog. I'm gonna be in Arizona for two whole months so i'll be here what's today like the 10th and 8th? no 9th august it it's august 9th and i'll be here until october 2nd i think so i'll be here a whole two months which, which will be really fun and we're gonna see what we get up to and you look, said october every time, 31st october 2nd oh every time you drive down the road there's just mountains oh. they look so pretty i'm getting the annihilator i looked it up because i don't really know what you get at dutch bros because like i don't come here often um but Featured the annihilator sugar-free in macadamia or something where do you order i think you order at the window yeah how's it going Hello. Uh, could I do the um incoming call? Press you. Sorry. Can... How's it going? Good. How are you guys? Good. Good. Doing great. Thanks. Do you have the uh, medium ice sugar free annihilator with two percent? Yes. Yep. Dope. Do you want a straw today? Yes, please. Perfect. There you are. And then we're still making that all night okay. fresh for you right now. Thank you. There's that for you. Thank you. You guys take care. Have a good one. You too. Oh, that's actually not bad. I like that. Oh, you like it? I like it better than... Oh, I'm not a big almond milk guy. Yeah, they're very vibes, bro. Mm -hmm. Vibes are high. They're happy people. This is actually pretty good. Yeah, I don't mind it. I told you, you'd like the 2%. It's not really even the 2%, but like, you oh, taste it. I already tasted it. Overall, my Dutch Bros is kind of solid. Yeah, even with the 2%. Yeah, they were out of every single non-dairy milk that they had. Like, oh, when he said they didn't have almond, I was like, oh, okay, can I get, like, oat? Because I'm, like, fine with oat. It's just not my favorite. He was like, no. So, I got 2%, but it's actually kind of good. Yeah. And I, obviously, like, like I said, we don't have Dutch Bros. So, I, like, never, I've gone one time, and I got, like, iced coffee with almond milk, and it was just, like, not what you get at Dutch Bros. So, it was, like, fine, but it wasn't, like, special. And so I looked up because all their coffees have like so much like sugar and like all that in it. So I looked up some like sugar free healthier alternatives and this one's actually pretty good. It was the Annihilator Skinny Sugar Free with 2% milk. Yeah, dude really needs that fucking sprawler. <laughs> he has a boot on his foot. Oh, he does? Yes. Oh, fair. Okay. That'll be a Sunday adventure. Send me a thousand dollars so she can't touch the a thing. A thousand? You'll buy my computer for me? Yeah, I'll buy your computer. Whoa, whoa, whoa no running start. <laughs> she can't get it. <laughs> Are you joking? We came to this little shopping center in Scottsdale to go to the Apple store. And now we're probably gonna be here all day. No, we're gonna maybe look at a computer I wanna buy and some headphones, but it's really cute here. Yeti. I saw a glimpse of glory, something I knew before. 
Right now I can't remember what I was hoping for. Then came a moving picture, pulling the wall again. I'll show you what you're missing. It's just around the bend. I'll we just got back from the store. You can probably hear Brendan in the other room. He's talking to his parents, but I wanted to do a little haul of everything that we got. Um, we went to the grocery store yesterday and kind of like stocked up on like actual food. So like got food. <laughs> There's like a lot of alcohol, um, but we got like food and stuff yesterday. And then today we went to Costco. And so I got some food, but also like mostly just like house stuff. Like I needed laundry detergent, some dryer sheets, like dishwasher pods. Um, there's no Tupperware here. So I got some yesterday, but they're kind of big. So I got some smaller ones. Um, we got some eggs from Costco. These were just like Ziplocs and whatever stuff um, that I needed. This is lotion. I got this. Ouch. I got this candle from Target and it's so big. I don't want to like drop it, but it's so big and so cute. And it's by the Casa Luna brand and it's the Serenity scent and it's my favorite. I used to have like an oil diffuser back in Michigan. Um, and then I got another one in Florida, but like never really had time to use it. So I got the candle because I'm so excited about that. And then... Hangers, just have like extra hangers in the closet because there's not that many. Um, I got this vase. I've been like picking at the sticker trying to get it off, but it's like a little flower vase. And then I got these flowers at Costco that I'm hoping if I cut them shorter will look okay in that, I hope. Um, more like random like body wash. This is Brennan's deodorant. Um, I got some strawberries and then this almond butter from Costco is like the best because it's one huge and almond butter is kind of expensive and this whole thing is six bucks and the ingredients are literally just roasted almonds like there's nothing else added which is really nice. Um, this is just magnesium that I take and then we got this huge thing of pita chips because that's like my favorite snack ever. And then we also got this cauliflower rice. It's in the freezer because we had it in the car for too long, but it's this like frozen cauliflower rice. That's like a pretty good deal. Um, and then what else? Brennan got like a huge pack of smart water because he's a freak and only wants smart water. Um, paper towel. And I got a table that I'm gonna use to can I put this in here? Oh my God, that's a good spot. I got a like folding table that I can use to put my computers on because right now they're right here, which you can see it's just like not a great setup. And I love when things are like clean. So I just like literally can't look at that all day, every day. So I got like a little table that I think I'm gonna put in the guest room and put my computers in there for now because I need somewhere to put them. And I like would like to be able to <laughs> use the table. So the lighting's low key weird, but I woke up at 4.45 this morning because I had to work at 5 a.m. because I work 7 a.m. Central time zone and we're in Pacific here because Arizona doesn't do daylight savings. So 5 a.m. to 2 p.m. is my normal work hours, but today I worked 5 to 10 because I took a half day so we could like finish getting settled and get all of our stuff. So it's kind of like a weird schedule, but now it's 4.40 and I'm like hungry for dinner because I... I don't know, like we have to go to bed at like nine. So <laughs> anyways, I'm going to get all this stuff put away and we'll see what we end up doing. We got dinner all chefed up and it looks so good. We're making like kind of like Greek Mediterranean bowls or whatever. And so we got a bunch of stuff at the store yesterday. Um, I got some feta today. So we have feta, hummus, um, this is like a tzatziki like yogurt um, dip, and then some cut up cucumber, onion, and then tomato, pita. Um, this is some cauliflower rice we just put in the microwave, and then this chicken, which what'd you put on it? Um, it has thyme, like an herb seasoning, 
uh, salt, pepper. It's like a mixed salt and pepper. And then a uh, little paprika. Um, Anyways, it's really yeah. good. We tried a bite and it was delish. So this is the little dinner setup. We had to pull the microwave out of this closet, but I have like, I had everything like stacked on top of it in here just to get it out of the way. But the microwave was like just sitting there. So now it's here on the floor. That's how we microwave the rice. Look at you, chef and um. Looks delicious. Brennan made himself like a little wrap. We've been watching Love Island. It's so good. We're almost done with it, honestly, but I finally just got caught up to where Brennan is, so we've been binging. <laughs> we just got all ready. We're going to a. You got it. Diamond. Diamondbacks. Diamondbacks? Yeah, you got it. Diamondbacks game. <laughs> We're going to a baseball game. Um, it's at Chase Field in Phoenix. And we just bought tickets. We got all ready and we're gonna go watch the game. I think we're going to, we're going to a place called Pizzeria Blanca. Bianco? I think it's Blanca. B-I-A-N-C-O. Bianco? Bianco? No. Um, we'll find out if they're... The Uber's about to be here, but we're Ubering over there. This is my little outfit that I put together. I don't really know if I love it, but we're going with it. I just have this black tube top from, honestly, Brandy Melville from like five years ago. And then this white like linen button down, these Levi shorts, and then just some Air Forces with little like ankle socks. And yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna have a good night. I didn't really vlog it all today because I just worked and Brennan golfed and that's pretty much all we did. And then we just hung out on the couch until we got ready, obviously. So we're gonna go to the game. I'm gonna vlog a little on my phone because I can't bring my camera, but I'm hoping that like my little bag will be fine. I think it will. Yeah, it's, it's so oh, small. Yeah. Oh yeah, it should be fine. I think it will be fine, yeah. but hopefully we don't take it. <laughs> I know a girl is so fine, she's running laps around my heart. She's more than perfect, she's not the type to go play a part She came and killed my whole life and just like Mike Tyson Now I'm here seeing stars I could take all of my time just trying to describe her I don't know where to start All my life I knew she's my baby I can't hide it, making me crazy Sometimes I close my eyes See 